Oh my goodness, this is very close up and personal. <laughs> see we are extremely zoomed in right now um so you get to see all of this absolute magnificence today but yes we are zoomed in because we are doing a completely different video today i am currently baby face but we will be fixing that in a moment sorry about the lighting i wanted to be as like close to the window as i could for like the light and obviously it like washes out my tan and then my face looks really pale which it is but like you know and also I apologize for the background instead of like a plain wall I haven't even told you what we're doing today but like the title in my video but the title of my video would have said it anyway we're doing a no mirror makeup challenge today that is right I'm doing something makeup related can you believe it no I cannot so basically all I'm going to do is apply my makeup without a mirror duh <laughs> I am looking in the viewfinder at the moment but I will switch that around for warning you I have the shittest products in my entire life okay I am not a makeup guru I am not a huge makeup fan so I have old products I have shitty products I have cheap products I have the type of makeup you were playing with when you were like six and seven <laughs> but yeah I'm just kind of gonna do what I would do normally. Okay, so let's get started. So I'm just going to put my hair up and I'm going to look like an absolute egg, but that's okay, all right? I'm just using my viewfinder for the time being. Okay, so we got our hair tied back and before I do the next step, I put on my face tan water after brushing my teeth, so that's all I've got on my face at the moment. So I'm going to turn around the viewfinder. I have no mirror, I swear to God. Okay, so my viewfinder is flipped around. I'm trying to do anything. <sighs> oh, before I do anything, I'm going to go in with some lip balm. I just use Nivea lip balm. Um, I just like to moisturize my lips. I literally have an obsession with this. And then, I really want to talk about this first product that I'm going to use. So, I don't actually use a primer for my makeup, but I do use this Cetaphil Sun Ultra Light Lotion. It's got SPF 50, and basically I will put this on my face every single morning. SPF is such a good thing to incorporate into your skincare routine. So I went to Chemist Warehouse, this thing was like 16 bucks. I do want to get a different one because I'm not the biggest fan of this. I think like it... I feel like it's a bit thick and it kind of makes my face look really white when you put it on. But I just said to myself, you know what, I'm going to use it until like it runs out. And then, oh my god, I can't even tell if this is going to be like blended in. Okay. Yeah, but if any of you guys actually use any um, SPF products for your face um, and you really like them, any cheap ones please, I would really like, like put it down in the comments down below. For those of you that don't know what SPF does, it basically it can prevent like... It can help in the prevention of like premature aging and stuff and obviously it helps like being in the sun because the sun is such a big contributor to like skin issues um especially me being a redhead like but like i said the set of fill one i'm not a big fan of it but it'll do me for now you know okay so next i'm moving on to eyebrows um i go in with my little ColourPop brow pomade and i use the real techniques eye brush set. Okay, I just got my eyebrows wet, so I'm kind of hoping that whatever hair I feel is purely eyebrow. <laughs> oh my god. I actually have work after this, so like I'm really hoping that it'll be okay. <laughs> and I'm really hoping that like it's not going to be horrendous and I can kind of just fix it up a little bit, you know? Oh, I don't know how forward to go. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to do this. This is so hard. Okay, you know what? I'm going to... Stick with that, hopefully that's okay. Next eyebrow. You know what, I think, I think my eyebrows are done. What if I made them super dark? Oh my God. Oh my God. So, eyebrows are done. Okay, I think I do foundation. Yeah? Yeah, I do foundation. I'm going to go in with this Flower Beauty Light Illusion foundation in the shade Classic Tan. So I'm just going to give the bottle a bit of a shake. There we go. 
I really don't have a method. I kind of go with one side of my face first. Oh. This is going to look absolutely horrendous. Also, um, I am still on the hunt for like, a lot of you guys have actually like, helped, been like trying to help me out and like have been suggesting a lot of um, like alternatives to a ring light. And um, I've really been looking into it. Like a few people have sent me like the little LED light switches that you get at Kmart and stuff. And bro, I was shopping all day yesterday and I could not find them anywhere in Kmart. Or like big w target and then i went to like cheapest chips and i got my i got josh like my partner to ask one of the guys and he was like nah sorry we don't sell them and then we went like we went walking for like a minute or whatever and we found them sitting right there but they were like they were like 12 dollars each or whatever and i was like bro i'm not spending that much on a fucking led light that i've seen like Kmart advertised for like two bucks. <laughs> I know that Kmart has, I think they've restocked online their like $20 ring lights, I think, but I was a bit anxious to buy it just because I feel like I want a tall one. I mean, at the moment it's okay. If I do sit down videos, it's fine. I think it'll be like the normal size of like my tripod, but if I'm doing videos where like I'm standing up and stuff, I feel like I am going to want a taller one. Oh, I've kind of like forgotten what I've done. Oh my goodness. I think this is blended out. I think. So next I'm going with concealer. Colourpop No Filter Concealer in the shade Fair. Oh, and I would conceal my eyebrows, but I feel like, to be honest, I don't conceal my eyebrows in general anymore. Unless I'm going out to like town or something, then I really will. But I just feel like concealing my eyebrows will be a bit difficult. So what do I put on my nose? I don't usually put it on my nose, but I will. <laughs> but here we go. And on the chin, on my T-zone. There. There. Oh god. Oh god. And there. Yeah? We'll go there. So under the eyeballs, we go down and it's like a triangle. Yeah? Okay, I'm hoping that looks okay. Nose. We're gonna do the nose. We're gonna do the nose. And oh, exciting news though. Me and Josh are actually really, really planning on buying a puppy, and I am so excited. Um, I really want to vlog like the whole um getting our puppy and stuff. I think that would be a cute video. And like, who doesn't want puppies? Come on. As soon as I get the puppy, I will be making Instagram for him or her. Um, I've always wanted to make like a puppy Instagram. I just think it's cute, you know? I think that's all the concealer blended out. I couldn't find my contour palette, so I'm gonna use a bronzer and this was literally a cheap like $4 bronzer I found at Chemist Warehouse. It's just called Jordana Powder Bronzer. It's in the shade Sunkissed. Funny story about um these brushes. As you can see, they look very cheap. I'm gonna go in with the bronzer by the way. They <laughs> They look very cheap, so um, my partner, I was like, you know what, for Christmas I think I would really like like a set of brushes, makeup brushes, um, just because I know I don't do much makeup, but like I have literally no brushes for anything. So I was like, just get me like a cheap but good pair, you know, I don't need like a James Charles brush set or anything. Um, and I was like, yeah, I'll be happy. Um, and then... <laughs> Christmas time comes around and I open up my gift <laughs> and what I see is I'm pretty sure maybe a $12 set from Kmart or something. <laughs> but yeah, he got me the brushes and it was just, I just laughed because it's such a typical guy thing to like, to get a cheap like set that's really, really shit instead of a cheap set that's like good for money, you know what I mean? Like, oh, it was just funny. But you know what? It's the thought that counts, and I absolutely love him. And I will admit, I use this brush for like my um powder all the time. This brush is actually not that bad. By the way, I have no lip products, it's really bad, but I just I don't have lip products because I just never I've never really gotten around to buying any. Anyway, this mascara, I have no idea what it's called. If anyone recognizes this, please let me know because I cannot find it anywhere. I'm pretty sure I, like, I pinched this from my best friend and um, I just never ended up giving it back to her. So I'm really sorry if you're watching this, like I apologize. 
how am I gonna do this? Okay. Okay. Don't poke myself in the eye. Don't poke myself in the eye. Don't. Just do my top lash and then stick on the lash. Um, I'm using these kiss lashes. I think they're the page boy ones. This is impossible. This. This is impossible. Oh my goodness. Oh, that does not feel. That does not feel okay. That does. Oh, oh, hold on. Wait, wait. By the way, I do actually put on my eyelashes with my fingers. I don't use tweezers or anything. You know what? I think that's a bit better. It feels a lot better than what I thought it was going to be. Oh my goodness. Did I actually manage to do this? Oh, look. The band's probably like so visible right now. You know what? That's... <laughs> that's how we're going to leave it. On to my second lash. Let's do this. Let's do this. I always... Oh my goodness. No. No, 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 no. What the fuck is that? No. Okay, hold on. Oh, I can't do this. Oh my goodness. Hold on, hold on. You know what? We just need to get it on the eye. We just need to get it on the eye. Okay, okay. <laughs> I can feel like that feels... No, I can feel like it looks ridiculous. Stretch it. Can I stretch it? Oh my god. No, you know what? I'm going to leave it at that. This is where I'm leaving it, guys. I'm going to put mascara on my bottom eyelash. Lip balm again. I'm just going with that again. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I don't use any setting sprays. I, I might do like one bit of eyeshadow. Okay, you know what? I'll go in with my Zodiac palette from Colourpop. I wanted this palette because it was all about um, Zodiac signs. That Taurus is like this brown shade here. I really hope I'm tapping the right one. Right there, <laughs> okay. So I'm just gonna, oh, it has a mirror on it. <gasps> I didn't even see, I'm telling you, I swear to God, I did not see the mirror, okay? Like I didn't see myself in the mirror. I saw the mirror, but I didn't see me, don't worry. I would have like reacted to that. So, I didn't look at the mirror, okay? I swear to goodness. But I'm just gonna go in like this. I think I'll just go like this actually. I meant to do this before lashes, so. Now I'm just ruining everything. Oh my god. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna look in the viewfinder. One, two, three. What the fuck? Can I just say, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. This eyelash is actually on quite well. This one, yeah, not so much. Look at the eyeshadow. Oh my god, maybe I should actually wear this eyeshadow a lot more often. Guys, that is my makeup done. This was the no mirror makeup challenge and I did a shit ton better than what I thought I was going to do. Even this, this eye is in so much pain. I can't figure out why. <laughs> what happened here? That is basically the video, guys. If it wasn't as entertaining as you thought, I am so sorry. Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy the video and you do like watching me <laughs> um then don't forget to give me a big fat like and click that subscribe button i really hope you guys liked it and don't forget to follow me on my instagram and yeah i will see you guys in my next video